What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Spanko and today we're here with Matthew and uh, he just came first place actually with Invoke, Shadal, Dogmatica, DPE, just engine.deck. Yeah, pretty much. Um, so yeah, let's go talk about your matches today. How did you feel? How do you feel about the deck and get into it? Uh, so, I mean, I played this deck because I was borrowing it from a friend. It was pretty good. I opened like the one of seven bricks like every game, but like it doesn't matter if you just open, you know, two engines. Yeah. Um, I think my hardest matchup today was full of race actually. That makes sense. It was kind of annoying, but like I opened evenly and that was fun. And then you're like, yeah, I'm good. Yeah, pretty All much. right, so let's get into it. All right, so, I mean, none of this stuff should be too surprising. I played three Alistair, three Meltdown, Terraforming, two Invocation. Yep, that's one engine. Yep. And then uh, Ecclesia, Fleur, Maximus. I opened this like every game, basically. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I still won, so that's cool. Uh, three Nadir, Punishment, Schism. Yep. I honestly want to cut this. Oh, it, really? It never came up. Like, <laughs> like a lot of the times, like, it would just kind of sit there, and I didn't want to lock myself out of the extra deck. Yep. So, I mean, going forward, I'd probably cut it. I'd have to test a bit more, though. How did Schism feel? Oh, it was great. I yes. won every game that activated it. So. Okay, yeah, there you go. Yeah. Uh, and then Third Engine, Fusion Destiny. So with, with this engine, are you ever making Verte or are you just hard drawing fusion? Um, I tried making Verte once and it got impermed, yep. so it didn't matter. But like 90% of the time, it was just a I hard drew this or I just drew it off Prosperity. Oh, so, okay. Like, that was good. Okay. Every time I saw it, it was mostly consistently good, but I got um, I got it banished quite a few times by like Stree. Oh, and, okay. Like, uh, my round two was against Sky Striker and I got banished quite a few times just because Shark Hand's a good card. Yeah. So. And then hand traps because this locals loses to hand traps. Ash, Veiler, Imperm. Yep. I think this was fine. Uh, I'm glad I didn't play Nib in the main because, like, I never would have come up. So. Okay. Uh, one cold, two cyclone. So uh, this is interesting. We were actually talking about this earlier. Uh, what's your mindset behind two cyclone? Um, well, I was thinking between one or like. It was either t uh, two or three, but I couldn't find the space for the third. But okay. the idea is that here, at least, everyone's playing back row, and this deck auto loses to uh, Imperial Order. Yep. So like, I would rather just have something to force out, um, you know, any kind of interruption. Like for example, for Wonder, you can just do this on like standby or draw to yep. get rid of their uh, trap card. Or like if you're playing the mirror, right, you can just banish the um, Schism from from the field as well. Yep. Uh, but at the same time, it just gets rid of the order and. I thought it was really good. Yep. I honestly think I should play three next time just because I played Mystic Mind round one and that was awful. Yeah. So, uh, two Prosperity because I only have two. Yep. Uh, three Droplet. How, how did Droplet perform for you today? Uh, it was good. I mean, like, for the most part, I honestly think that, like, Chalice probably would have been better. Okay. Because, uh, like, most of the time when I used it, I would only use it to, like, get one. Yep. It, like, I think one match. I did uh, drop it for two, but like for the most part, it was mostly just like one for ones that I needed. Yeah. So I mean, I don't know. I think it's just like a it depends on where you're playing kind of thing. Yeah. And then last card, reboot. Of course. Uh, this place has too many stun players, so it's good. So okay, okay. I was gonna say potentially could the reboot be a third cyclone? Oh yeah, hundred percent. Okay. Um. That or I could replace the punishment next time for a third cyclone. Oh okay, okay. If I play this deck again, I'll probably try that. And then for extra, uh, Winda, App Cologne, Construct, Raijin, Agoides, Purgatrio, uh, Double Mechaba. Yep. Um, Raijin was cool. It won me uh, one game today. Yep. Just because I was able to flip it face down when I got punishmented. Oh, nice. So, I mean, that was pretty good. I almost want to play three Mechaba because I. Uh, suck at managing resources, so... Uh, so you're like, let me just spam my mecha buzz. Honestly, yeah. Um, Titanic Cloud was great. Uh, Double Entus, this was good for basically every back row matchup, because I would just open Nadir and just blow apart their board. Okay. Um, DP, best card. Of course. Uh, then the Almirage, Gardna, and the Verte. Standard. Yeah, pretty standard. And then for side... Last minute addition because Fluandries is here. How good of it? Like how good of a card was it today? Uh, if I saw it, it would have been great. But oh, so you didn't see I it? I did not see it at all. I think so. I mean, in theory, it's good. Okay. Uh, MVP. 
Oh, only two. I don't own a third. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, if I had the third, I'd play it, but I I went evenly for like nine cards in my Fluonaries match. You guys will see it. It'll be on the channel. It was pretty sick. Yeah. So, uh, Triple Lightning Storm, second MVP. Good card. And then... And then this is Triple Dark Ruler never came up. Okay. Triple Nib never came up. And then, you didn't play any combo today, huh? No, I did not. Yeah. And then the last card, because I honestly just didn't know what to put in, I just put in tactics. Yeah, we were talking about this. This could be like a third cosmic or like a random hand trap. Third evenly. Third evenly was like usually the answer, but again, I don't have a third. So. Yeah, so the TTT it is. Yeah. All right, so how did you feel? I want to ask, how did you feel about the deck overall? Like, did it ever break for you? I know you kept saying you drew the floor, I but like... pretty hard in my striker match where I opened um, Dasher, Celestial, Fleur de Lis, I think Ash, Imperm. Oh, okay, yeah. And I lost that really hard, but he, but the thing is, is he opened Dasher, Celestial too, so it was, it was, a, it was surprisingly back and forth. Okay. But, um, um, that sucked. I opened Flirtily, like I said, a lot. Yeah. I opened Celestial or Dasher like two or three times. So like it wasn't like bad. And then like the one the one thing is I'm surprised that I never drew into the trap cards like the Schism and the Punishment. Yep. Because like I expected those to kind of drag me down, but I mean, luckily they didn't. Yeah, thankfully they didn't. XO today. It's kind of the issue with this deck that I just have where it's like everything in this deck feels like a brick sometimes so i don't know it's just because it's engines right you don't yeah. feel like you're playing a deck you feel yeah, like you're playing a bunch much. yeah it's not really the most interesting deck but it does the job i guess would you recommend taking out any of these engines or changing up any of the engines i know you said the punishment but i other think than that. it's just the punishment everything else was really good okay like nadir's broken meltdown's broken fusion destiny's great card so um, if you guys want to see any of the matches, he actually had like three feature matches because this guy just stuck to table one. Yeah. Uh, so you guys can see this, uh, the feature matches. It'll be on the channel soon. Thank you, Matthew, for the deck profile. Congratulations on your XO. And uh, with that, Spanko. Oh, make sure to like and subscribe. And yeah, I have to say, I'm a YouTuber, bro. I have to say. Oh, yeah, you know it. And with that, Spanko signing out. Peace.